The first group that's going to open the show tonight is a really, really great group. They are a bi-coastal duo uh, from, from New York and Whistler, BC, respectively. Uh, and they are the only slow comedy duo named after an obscure Canadian television show that you will ever see. <laughs> uh, the show you're about to see is completely 100% improvised. Please welcome, from all over North America, Buckshot and Benny. I'm gonna hop. Do it then. No. Huh? No. I didn't do that right? The one that the rock lands on is the skip one. Oh, I thought you just... I played, I played differently in Calgary. Watch and learn. Okay. Okay, okay. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. In Calgary, we just throw it past. <laughs> and then you have to jump past it. You this is a big adventure for me. My mom says this is a big adventure. So I'm trying to take it really slow. The move. It's pretty large. Does she pick you up after school? Yeah, because I don't know the way home yet, and it's only like two blocks, and I don't know. I'll know. So I used to walk home from Calgary all the time from school. I'll know it soon. What? Do it's I not long enough to braid. It will be soon, I promise. I'll grow it long so you can braid it, I promise. Okay. It's you cool. Now that I'm on the West Coast, I should have braided hair, right? Oh, okay, we're doing that? Okay. <laughs> Remember that rock. We'll, we'll pick it up if we want to play again. So now we're, now we're well, we can't be bro brothers because you're a girl, but are we spit siblings now? <laughs> yeah? Yeah. Cool. Wait, hold it a second more. Okay. hum well, I've never seen that before. I don't know. They do it in church sometimes. <laughs> <laughs> we'll do it again. OK. I don't go to church because I'm Jewish. <laughs> I go to synagogue. It's really boring. It's... Church is boring, too. Really? Yeah. Yeah, I don't, ugh. I don't like synagogue, except my, my grandma, when we used to live in Calgary, um, she used to always give me raisinettes wrapped in a napkin in her purse when we were in synagogue together. Really? Yeah, but, but then she died, and then we didn't have a reason to live in Calgary anymore. <laughs> so that's why we moved here. Are raisinettes, like, are raisinettes the ones that are raisins, but they have chocolate on the outside? Yes. That's tricky. What? I don't like being given healthy food mm -mm. inside. Uh! Yeah! Mm -mm. Uh, I don't like 
being given healthy food inside of real food, like chocolate. No, but it's kind of cool because, like, leave it to a grandma to take a healthy food and make it good for kids, right? Because that's what grandmas are supposed to do, right? My grandmas are dead. M well, one of mine is. <laughs> and then the other one lives in New York. And she might as well be dead. <laughs> because all she does is just stay in her apartment all day and talk about her ex-husband. And then sometimes she goes to the club and eats at the club. And when I go visit her in New York, I have to wear a suit and a tie at the club. It's so stupid. Is it like a nightclub? No, it's like a club for Jews. <laughs> it's, it's all Jews. Like Knights of Columbus. I don't know what that is, but I'm guessing that's like the same thing for Christian people. Not all Christians, just Italian ones. OK. Cool, yeah, yeah, yeah. It's yeah. probably like that. I don't like going there at all. It's really stupid. I really like New York, but I do not like going to the club. I want to show you something. OK. There's a stump over here. I wrote my name on it. Yeah? Yeah, I want you to write your name on it, too. But closer, closer to my name than that other name. That's Emily. She moved away. Where did she go? I don't know. Her mom and her dad got really mad at each other, and then everybody just kind of went their separate ways. Oh, they got a divorce. A, you don't know what a divorce is? A divorce is when a husband and a wife can't reconcile their differences, <laughs> so they split up. Yeah. Yeah. My parents aren't divorced, but my cousin has, my aunt's divorced from, it's awful. It's a bad situation. OK, I, I don't have anything to write my, you carry a knife? At Vancouver. <laughs>